Hi guys, welcome to Tutors Funny channel. Let's continue our tutorial. Now here I'm going to search the customer details. So I have to put one button here. This one should be search. So here we have to right here I'm going to get the button which uh, name we have to press just search right perfect now we will be able to search the customer details right uh, enter the enter by the ID here right so here right click event action action perform right now here what I'm going to do is here I'm going to the same code go to the project add custom uh, search customers the same code find here this one the same code we have to copy this one we have to copy only this one right we no need the radio button other stuff we no need it we have to copy this one and so we have to copy all the stuff right. after that we have to remove copy like this right now control C to copy control V to paste it paste to ticket here okay now here we remove the try here here we have to surround with the try and catch now we have to copy this one all the stuff control X to cut off you have to put it inside the Now here, um, we need to add the catch, right here we need to add the catch, now the error go away, like the error go away. Now here what I am going to do is here, uh, I am going to, this one should be the customer finding, so this one should be the, what is the text box name here I am going to give here we have to give txt cast id right okay. txt cast id right now here we have to write as txt cast id here now here we have to find the customer details uh, by the id here and here if the record is not found the, uh, if you uh, if you enter the wrong id record not found message display otherwise we no need this uh, this one also this one we no need it we have to remove all the stuff we know need only uh, first name and last name and password passport number only so the remaining stuff we know needed so this three data we need so here we have to remove all the stuff this thing we need right so here we have to what is the name here this one you have to change it as a txt first name this name txt last name txt passport this one right the setup you have to write so here you have to write right txt passport right txt name txt last word passport right that's the only thing you have to write okay now here else we have to close the bracket right that's the only thing we have to write now here right this error else we need another right, right. we need to cut off this line we don't need it the additional catch block is there this is the i wrote two times that's why the error should be displayed now it's okay with the code now here txt first name last name txt passport all stuffs are correct uh, now here is the variables the first name last name passport right this is these columns are coming from the this one search customer search okay. first name last name passport right now let's check whether it's working fine or not Yes. 
जीरो जीरो वन ठीक है सक्सेसफुल डिस्प्ले टू डिस्प्ले थ्री एक्ट नोट फॉर इट सक्सेसफुल डिस्प्ले द कस्टमर डिटेल्स राइट नाउ आफ्टर दैट वी विल डू द दिस स्टफ राइट नाउ हियर गो टू द डिजाइन नाउ हियर राइट क्लिक इवेंट हियर वी हैव टू राइट माउस क्लिक इवेंट माउस क्लिक दिस वन वी हैव टू क्लिक राइट here we have to write the code for that you have to write default the same the table name this one you have to get this one model right control it copy this model we no need to write again by again uh, this this is the default model df this how we have to display the data and set into the relevant field right here this one search coding we have to code this one Uh, copy this one right can you see to copy this one and control v to paste here right we no need this one only this we need and we have to set the set int set index selected index equal j table 1 dot get selected row right here i am going to uh, the result should be display on here right when the person click on the flight information result should be display flight number flight name departure and price only display okay so here what i am going to do is here we have to call the relevant text box name change the name flight number this one flight name this one departure time txt d p t only right that's the thing you have to write right first time i am going to write this here as first one is uh, flight number txt flight number this one is a flight number right Now here, flight number dot set text. We have to set text. We have to display the uh, value of here. What is the diff? Df. This object Df is a object. Here we have to change this one as a D. This one, this D capital D dot get get value. Uh, here we have to write get value at this one. We have to write here as a selected index. Control C to copy. Control V to paste here. Here we have to write as a zero position mean flight number dot to string. Because the zero the table row has been starting from zero position. Uh, flight number zero. This one. Uh, that's 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 how it's working. Flight name and departure time. Right. So here uh, this one zero. This one uh, one two. Three, four, five. Right. We have to give the ID here. Right. So now, after that, control C to copy, control V to paste here. This one should be name. After that, control C to copy, control V to paste. This one, uh, text boxes. What is the name here? Give TXD depart. We just give us TXD depart. This one, TXT flight name or flight name, right? That's the stuff you have to give, right? Give the proper name here, right? Now, here we have to set the position of one. This one should be five, fifth position. The departure time zero, one, two, three, four, five, fifth position. So the record should be displayed, right? Now let's check whether it's working fine or not. book ticket uh, auto number generated i didn't set i have to set that things as well so here go to the add flight this is auto auto number generated codes you have to copy the code okay you no need to write the code again by again uh, once you write you have to reuse it okay that's a proper way okay you just copy this one control c to copy this code uh, go to the ticket this one 
source you have to write the function right here we have to set it as here as this one should be what is the uh, number you have to give as txt txt ticket can see it copy right so control v to paste control v to paste here like this one here we have to ticket number from ticket ticket set table name ticket set table name here we have to write this one as a t all the stuff correct here starting uh, this one t c zero zero right this out right now let's check whether it's working fine or not right this function we have to call control c to copy control v to paste table after the initialization right here when the program is executed it is loading here Init initial component when all the components will be displayed along with the uh, ticket number right what's the error what is error build error ah, here we have to the loop i think right error go away ticket display successfully now if you if you are going to search the flight to uh, sri lanka click search flight should be there enter the customer details uh, this information will be displayed here now if you select the flight flight information will be displayed successfully now we have to select the uh, class and we have to select the price right class will be able to select here this one select this one right click properties model here we have to remove them instead of here you have to write economy 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 this one for business right. business class right we have to write two classes after that this one flight txt flight we have to txt price you have to write the price this one this one also def uh, edit text we have to remove them this one also display while you click this one charge uh, price charge should display so here so here and this is the while you click the table the data should be display so here i'm going to change this one control c to copy another thing we have to get it as a txt price price and this one position will be 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7th position so you have to give here as a 7th position right that's the thing you have to do now let's check this one whether now let's check whether it's working fine or not go to the tickets tickets everything fine china fine customer we have to to find select the flight details here everything fine here we will be able to select the classes and here we have to select the sheets if you select the sheets here the price should be the total price should be display here the amount right so here let what i'm going to do is here i'm going to write here as a another label i have to put one label here here this one should be we have to change the txt total total txt total we have to change the text as uh, text let's increase the font style as with bold 8 to 4 right like this with the red font color we have set as a red successfully red display right perfect now here if you are select the seats and this is the price the total will be displayed here so you select this uh, this one right click event change state changed right this is the property you have to write the course so here we have to first we have to write as a int price property price because you no need to uh, don't write string now i am going to uh, do the calculation part 
with the calculation part you have to write the int okay int price he called if you, if, you, if it is a no, no cal calculation you you will be you will be able to write the string okay now you have to do the calculation part so integer dot pass pass int here we have to write the txt price you have to calculate txt price dot get string get text get text right after that int quantity equal integer dot pass int you have to write as a txt sheets this one what are that what is the name i gave sorry i didn't give the name txt sheets txt sheets dot get text get text txt sheets sorry not get text this one should be the uh, spina tool so that you have to write a get value get value get value dot to string that's the stuff we have to write after that we have to write a total dot int dot equal price multiply by quantity right we have to display the results at this here what's the name i have give change variable txt total txt total txt total dot txt total what is the problem txt dot why why it's not displaying this one change variable txt the txt total so we have to write we missed one total dot set x here we have to uh, write the uh, write as a uh, string dot value of you have to pass the total here this total you have to pass here right now let's check whether it's working fine or not right we have to multiply two things right and get the value right we had convert as a string now here take out sri lanka right select this one here we have to able to add the price details right now here if you are if you are increases uh, here one mean nine nine thousand if you have a two ticket two tickets three tickets we are booking this is the total price okay this is how you have to calculate the price after all the stuff are calculated you have to cl click book it will be book booking ticket will be booking it, it will be uh, store in the database table right uh, in this uh, in this uh, stuff i will do in my next tutorial uh, thank you for watching if you like my channel please subscribe me like me thank you for watching